Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new vlog. Now today is more of a little, a little update on my life. Now this is about my job situation. I've done these videos before. This one's actually slightly more positive in a way than the other one. There is still a negative side to it, unfortunately. My hair today, I'm sorry, it's so messy. Like if I could find that hat, you remember that hat I used to use in these vlogs? But uh, anyway, and that looks so weird now, doesn't it? We just, right, that looks a little bit weird, but I'm gonna go with it because my hair is just such a mess that it looks awful. I know my head's a really funny shape, so when I put a hat on, it looks ridiculous. But anyway, today is actually the last day that I am at my current job. Oh, I didn't go in yesterday, and basically, I had an issue with someone that worked there. Now, you may think like, Christ, what have you done to annoy them? Genuinely nothing, and that's that's the annoying thing with this this woman. She, um, you know, she was genuinely lovely at first. Like, I worked with her, she trained me how to do everything, and everything was good. And then the last like two or three weeks, she's just been constantly picking at me, just little things and just, it's the way she will go about it, you know, to anyone else who does something wrong or, you know, accidentally forgets to put this in. Because basically what we did was make light fitting. So you'd have someone at the top of the line who would put like all the components on, drill them down, put little bits in for the wires to come through and stuff like that. And then you'd have, you know, the wirers, the packers, the testers and all that. And I did the bit at the start, which was called clipping and choking and the wiring and I was doing the clipping and choking the other day, you know, putting the balls down, and I thought, you know, sometimes when you screw it into the plastic, like, body, um, the screw would fall out, and she basically, it happened a few times, and I didn't know that you had to use a fatter screw for it to work, and this hat just doesn't want to stay on my head, does it, to be fair, there we go, um, yeah, I was using a plastic screw, not a plastic screw, I kept coming out the plastic, so when she picked it up to go to wire it, it would fall out, and it, it, you know, it happened maybe two or three times in like three or four hours, and she got so frustrated, she was like, you know, you put the wrong screw in there again, and stuff like this, slammed it down on my desk, and then when I made her stuff, because if she was waiting for work, because you know, it goes down in a production line, so you start at the top, where people were making the boards and putting the stuff on, then it get past the wire, then to the tester, then to the packer, and then out into the pallet, so basically, um, that had happened, and then she was like, you know, she just kept being really rude, so I'd give her something she wouldn't say thank you for it, and her whole attitude towards me was absolutely horrible. Now you may think maybe she was just having a bad day, now that's the reason I knew she wasn't having just a bad day, was because to everybody else, even the people next to me, she was absolutely perfectly nice to me, but as soon as I spoke to her, it changed like that, literally, you could see it in her face. One minute she'd be happy, as soon as I spoke to her, her mood would go, and I'm thinking to myself, I've never done anything to this woman, like, and genuinely, I don't know if you guys can tell, but when I'm at work, I literally get on with my own work, I don't really socialise with people, I don't like to, I don't know, I'm just, I keep to myself, I'm a very shy person, I always have been. As a child, I was always very shy as well, you know, my parents would tell you that, my friends would probably tell you that as well, I'm not a particularly confident person, I never have been. So, for this woman to have a problem with me for nothing, really aggravated me, so basically, I had another job offered to me about a month ago and I didn't take it because I was carrying on at this place I thought I was gonna get offered a contract and I probably still could have you know I've just literally been on the phone and said I don't want to go back because I'm, to be honest I'm not gonna be putting up with it and this new job guys actually is very very good for you guys now if I can load the email that I've got um, I can show you now basically it's working at a frozen food place now I was never keen on the idea of working with food but this is frozen food and I don't think you have to wear any of that shoot like you know the suits and stuff um, and like hair nets and stuff like that because that's just queer isn't it you know we don't want to be doing that so uh, yeah basically um, it is four nights a week 2 p.m. start until potentially 11 p.m. or 3 in the morning which may sound like crazy hours it could be crazy hours but the good thing is it's four nights a week which is I think it's Sunday Monday Wednesday and Thursday so you never work more than two days in a row which I think is incredible I get a Tuesday off which you know will be amazing because you may be like, Tuesday, all your friends will be at work, there will be nothing to do. That's where YouTube comes in. That's where you guys come in. Um, and you can see here, I don't know if I've got any details to actually tell you, but basically, I'm going, to, going for an induction tomorrow, which is going to be Wednesday the 29th, and I'll be starting on the 3rd, which is next Monday. So, although I'm going to miss out on kind of like a week's worth of money, um, I'm not too bothered because this job, it is a little bit further to travel, but I think it's going to be a much nicer job to actually do you know um i'm not too sure how it's going to go i'm kind of worried that i've made a mistake with this but to be honest i don't think working with someone that's going to be that arrogant is good and this job also is much better pay like it's considerably better pay and it will make up for the kind of extra miles that i'm having to go and i think i'll just generally be happier somewhere where 
this job is basically picking frozen products and I like picking I did picking at the job that I was at about in November when I you know my my, my job at the chemical factory um, so hopefully guys it's gonna be a really good step forward and I just wanted to update you guys with that I know this has been a fairly long and drying out video but I just wanted to let you guys know because it means I'm going to have Tuesdays off, Fridays and Saturdays, I think. I think that's the shift pattern. I think it's Sunday, Monday, Wednesday and Thursdays, which isn't too bad. Yes, the hours could be fairly long, but to be honest, I'm ready for it. You know, the pay gets really good. Like, if you do over 40 and 50 hours a week, so over 40 hours, there's like a set pay. Over 50, there's a set pay. And it, it's actually really good pay and it could benefit me massively financially because the amount of money that I could be pulling in from this job is like obscene like genuinely for someone like me to be earning that sort of money potentially it's very exciting and it's only four days a week which is incredible yes it is potentially going into the early hours of the morning i don't really mind like, i'm a night owl you know i've been working on an evening shift for a long time but what this also means is before i start on monday i've got a few days to really try and grind out some videos so let me know what you want video wise guys we are going to be cracking on with the my player i'm probably going to try and record an episode of that this afternoon and yeah thank you so much for watching this vlog that is a short update though on the job situation so i hopefully guys will be in a new job very very soon um i've got an induction tomorrow as i said at nine o'clock until 11 and then i'll be starting on monday at 2 p.m everything is really looking up guys so thank you so much for watching if you have enjoyed if as always we can smash over five likes that would be absolutely awesome if you haven't already please do go and subscribe to the channel and i'll speak to you guys in the next video very very soon Peace.